um good good day good day um uh, viewers all over the world um on this quick video i'm not gonna talk too much about the market today right um i just wanna highlight on the most important criteria uh, or condition that we normally face um normal basis as traders right um it's either I will be emphasizing this message um, either on newbie traders or experienced traders right um, so the thing is I just want to highlight on this um, listen we all lose money in the market right we all make money in the market right but the most important thing is how do you come back from the setbacks or from the hiccups of the market right um, I just want to highlight the fact that the market is a psychological thing, right? The market is a psychological game, meaning that um, it's either you take it as a game or you take it as a business, right? So there are two traders on a normal basis. There are those who take Forex as a, as a game, right? And there are those who take Forex as a business. And guess what? Um, they won't pay you the same. They won't pay you the same. So it depends on how you trade or how you approach or how you respect the market right or how you behave um, through the market right it's a decision that you will make but I just want to talk to those who like feel like this forex thing is not working out who like who, who feels like um, there's nothing that is happening there's no possibility for them to grow accounts is a possibility for them to make it in the market right let me highlight just one fact the main fact is that we mostly traders experienced um or not experienced we blow accounts at some point right we also lose money we also lose money so this is the kind of information that mainly we don't share um many traders don't share business people don't share this right but it's a story that is reality it happens mostly in, in in a normal basis or each and every day or so we also blow accounts so um, what i'm trying to highlight is the fact that it is not only you that is losing money right it is not only you that is losing money in the market we all lose money it is not only you that blows accounts we all blow accounts it is not you that um, find the strategy to be a little bit uh, misconfusing or confusing or you know deliberately not working in your favor um it is not you that is going through this situation of setbacks of hiccups you know um of losing or losses on a normal basis right um at some point you will go through a week with losses at some point you'll go through you know days days and nights hours of losses you know days without sleep um nights without sleep you understand what i'm saying so basically the main thing that you must always put in mind is that if this is not only you right it's not only you that is not making it in the market it is not only you that is having problems it is not only you that is blowing accounts it is not only you that is losing money so the moment you remember how to like uh, balance or how to to push, you know, um, your psychological thinking or your psychological part or psychological part of you, um, when it comes to the market, then everything will just be a little bit uh, easy for you, you know, in, 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 in terms of holding your breath from losses in terms of like um moving away from the market quite some time you understand so remember like i said um the market is a psychological thing so most of the time always um build always practice um your mind to always be strong practice your mind to always be positive even if the market is not going your way practice your mind to be positive even if the strategy is not working on your favor. So always practice your mind to be positive, even in setbacks, even in losses, even in accounts blowing. Always practice your mind to take the pain. 
you know, to push through the pain or to push through the situation. So most of the time when we lose, you just have one loss, two losses, then you're just out of the market. You feel like this thing is not working out. You feel like you'll never make it in this thing. Let me give you an advice, right? Um, Forex is a psychological game. Always practice your mind to be positive. Then in that way, you will know how to heal from the broken wounds of the market. The market will deliberately, the market will hurt you, right? And this is not an information that we are familiar we are familiar with this is not some kind of content we familiarize with ourselves with right we just want to get into the market and just that is, that is it but the most important thing we must always remember forex is a psychological thing so you can't come to the market with those emotions that are negative let me tell you let me just give you a clear view of what i'm talking about right not to confuse you um you can't come to the market firstly when you're having a bad day secondly you can't come to the market with a negative emotion you can't come to the market with negativity you're not gonna make money you're not gonna win you're not gonna take your profit why because emotion once your emotions are negative once your emotions are involved then the results will be the same your emotions are the one uh, that limits your capacity of winning or, or losing. It's two things, right? If you have a negative emotions, then the results will be negative. But if you have a positive emotion, then the results will be uh, positive. So make sure, that's why I told you that this is a psychological thing. Why? Because it works with your brain. It works with your emotions. It tests your heart. You know, if your heart is beating faster, it's like the market is just moving faster according to your heart, heartbeat. But if you, you know, your heart is moving slow, it's like, it's like it's studying the way you think. It's studying every movement that you make. This is a movement. Once you enter the trade, you move with the market. Either you go up bullish or either you go down bearish. You understand? So the market will move according to your pace. So it's, it's how we think that the market is doing. But basically, the market is just moving on its own. The market doesn't move according to your pace. The market doesn't move according to whatever that you're playing. But the market is just moving on its own. You understand? So in the reality, we believe that, no, the market is just against me because, you know, the market doesn't love me or market makers are just against me. Huh? Doesn't work like that. Make sure that your emotions are in place. Make sure that you, you are good, you are, you, you are strong enough, you know, to hold the, the, the trade, to wait for the take profit to be hit. Be patient enough to hold your emotions. You see, once you can beat the market from this, and secondly, once you can beat the market from patience, everything will be easy for you. Because the moment you decide that a trade might be going against you, then you just get out of the market just like that. And then only to realize the market will continue to move on your direction. Then you are out of the market. What? It beats you in the mind. It says no. You know, sometimes you blow an account. Why? Because the mind is telling you, no, the market is going on a di direction. Enter other trades. Enter other trades. And then once you enter two or three trades, now the market will tell you, or oh, the mind, to be preferably, the mind psychology will tell you that, change the lot size, make it a little bit bigger, because you can see the market is going on a direction. And once you've done that, the market moves on an opposite direction, then you do what? You blow an account. Why? Because you are defeated in the mind. So make sure uh, your psychological kind of thinking is positive. In either way, then you can... You can make it in this thing. Because this this is a journey. It's not a once-off thing. It's not a morning, uh, later kind of a success. You know, you don't just wake up and you are successful in the market, right? This is a journey. You have to practice. So a lot of things that you have to go through is your emotions, um, working with your mind, and also um, taking care of your health, you know, in order to think effectively, in order for your brain to function um, effectively, so that the psychological thinking um, can also be effective, you know, 
so it, it, it's all of one of those things that you, you must always go through remember you must always have a positive mindset right you must have patience in the market you must work on your time management right and also you must get the skill of being um positive at wrong situations or being positive when you are losing you know so this is why just a quick advice um to traders all over the world like always remember this um whether you are an experienced trader or a beginner trader remember this your psychological thinking must be positive once the market beats you from the mind then you are done before it goes to 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 the chat to the chat part before we go to the craft before we go to the take profits we go before we go to the stop loss first it start first with your mind once you are planning there and thinking of what what to make or which pair to trade that is when the market will beat you before you even open trades already before you lost the market already beating you in your mind so that is why it's very important to practice um, the psychological thinking to be effective all the time, all the time. So make sure, guys. Um, I so wish that in the market we can all succeed, you know, uh, so that we we can understand what is this forex thing that we are fighting with, you know. But basically, you, you just have to go through this. Just try to practice them. Then you will come after and tell me how how it was. And based on the previous videos, I just want to thank everyone. Everyone who have been commenting. Um, those who have been subscribing. Those who have been referring. You know, and also the positive feedbacks and also the negative ones. Because um, we are also motivated by the negative and the positive side of the story. You know. So we bring all these comments together and just to find out the good results and they give us more motive, more energy, more power that we have to come back and work even more, you know. So I'm, I'm just having a session right now. Um, then, yes, um, come back and just do comment, um, do like and subscribe so that we can follow up with more content that is coming right so remember the moral of the story is it is not only you that is failing don't feel like you are a loser um don't feel like you you are defeated in this world right because once forex starts beating you up once you start not making it in the market you will feel like the world is just against you you will feel like there's nothing that is worth you you know, or worth your, your sacrifices, worth your hustle. You will feel like nothing is going to work out for you, right? So please just make sure that you work on the psychological part and make sure that you are always positive so that you can enter the market with different energy, right? You can't come back with the previous energy of yesterday, of losses, and then today you come with the same energy. No, it won't work. You will still have the same result. So... Always be positive, always have patience, always take pain or always take losses as a motivation. Then you can come back strong, then you will keep on like increasing. That is how you improve, by the way. So make sure that you go through those um, hidden, you know, prospects of the markets and the psychological part of the market. I, I hope this video really benefited some of us or some of you. And yes, I hope it will boost your confidence at some point that remember you are not the only one.